In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Greetings devoted viewers and welcome to Living the Word channel. Here, we walk together in faith's radiance and trace the steps of the Holy. Today we have the privilege of unveiling another chapter from the extraordinary lives of men and women who have tread the path of sanctity. As we delve into their narratives and teachings, let's open our minds to the insights and divine grace they bestow. Their journeys offer us not just inspiration, but also guidance on our own spiritual paths. Let's together celebrate the abundant legacy of our Catholic faith, growing nearer to God through the life stories of His faithful followers. Thank you for being part of this enriching faith and inspiration journey. Today, our path leads us to discover the life and virtues of St. Catherine Drexel. Before we delve into her story, I kindly invite you to subscribe to our channel so you can continue to be inspired by the lives of the saints. St. Catherine Drexel, born on November 26, 1858, in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, is a remarkable figure in the history of the Catholic Church in the United States. Her journey towards sainthood is a story of deep faith, compassion, and an unwavering commitment to social justice. Catherine was the daughter of the wealthy American financier and philanthropist, Frances Anthony Drexel. Her early life was marked by tragedy when her mother, Hannah Langstroth, passed away just weeks after Catherine's birth. Raised in a philanthropic family, Catherine and her siblings regularly participated in charitable works, distributing food, clothing, and money to the needy directly from their home. The pivotal moment in Catherine's life came during a trip with her family to the Western United States in 1884. There, she was deeply moved by the poverty and destitution of Native Americans living on reservations. This experience, coupled with the profound impact of her stepmother's long and painful battle with cancer, solidified her calling to serve the marginalized. After inheriting a vast fortune upon her father's death in 1885, Catherine, true to her deep sense of responsibility towards the underprivileged, continued the family's legacy of establishing schools and churches for African Americans and Native Americans. Her commitment to education as a means of upliftment for these communities was unwavering. In a significant meeting with Pope Leo XIII in January 1887, Catherine sought help for mission schools. Challenged by the Pope to devote her life to the missions, she took a decisive step towards religious life. In 1889, she joined the Sisters of Mercy in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, as a novice. By February 1891, Catherine took her final vows and founded the Blessed Sacrament Sisters for Indians and Colored People, of which she became the Superior General. Catherine Drexel's contributions to society are vast. She used her inheritance to fund schools and churches and was actively involved in the welfare of American Indians and African Americans. Her efforts towards addressing social inequality among minorities and promoting quality education for all are part of her enduring legacy. Her Sainta journey began with her beatification by Pope John Paul II on November 20, 1988, following the recognition of a miracle attributed to her intercession. She was canonized on October 1, 2000, becoming the second American-born saint. The Vatican highlighted her legacy as one of love for the Eucharist, courage in addressing social inequalities, efforts in education, and selfless service. Her feast day is observed on March 3, the anniversary of her death. Catherine Drexel is regarded as the patron saint of racial justice and philanthropists. Her final resting place is in the Cathedral Basilica of Saints Peter and Paul in Philadelphia. Her life and works continue to inspire many, with numerous Catholic parishes, schools, and churches named in her honor across the United States. Let us now join together in prayer, inspired by the life of St. Catherine Drexel. Heavenly Father, in the spirit of St. Catherine Drexel, we come before you with hearts open to your will. As Catherine dedicated her life to serving the marginalized and seeking justice for all your children, guide us to follow in her footsteps with compassion and courage. 
Grant us the wisdom to see your face in every person we meet and the strength to act as instruments of your love and peace. Help us to champion the causes of education and equality, inspired by Catherine's unwavering commitment to these noble endeavors. May we, like St. Catherine, use our blessings not for personal gain, but to uplift others, especially those in dire need of support and kindness. Let her life of selfless service be a beacon for us, illuminating the path to a world filled with your grace and mercy. We ask this through Christ our Lord, who reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen.